Asus VivoBook. Model number X510UA. Press power button. Showing light for a moment, then it's gone. Showing power LED for a moment. Let's fix it. We have already opened all screws. Remove base rubber and open screws. Open back cover with opener. Remove the battery connection first. Remove keyboard connection. Connect battery connection again. Put multimeter on diode mode. Put red crop on USB connector. Put black crop on keyboard connectors pins. Check keyboard connectors pins one by one. Power light is on. It's working perfectly. Disconnect the battery. Hard drive is dead. We will remove this hard drive. Put new 240 gigabyte SSD and four gigabyte RAM in second slot. We will put this new keyboard on laptop. Disconnect fan connection. Remove hard drive. Remove Wi-Fi connection. Put this new four gigabytes RAM and RAM slot. Put this new 240 gigabyte SSD and laptop. This side should be on upper side. Let's try new keyboard first. Remove this plastic first. Put the double side tape for test. Connect the new keyboard connection. Connect battery connection. Connect the bootable USB drive. Press the power key. It's working perfectly. It's booting from USB. Next, click Install Now. Accept and Next. Select Custom Option. Select Partition and Next. Select country. Select keyboard layout. Enter name.
Windows is installed. Let's shut down and replace the keyboard. Remove the battery connection. Remove the new keyboard. Remove Wi-Fi connections. Remove the battery. Disconnect the fingerprint connection. Disconnect the mouse pad connection. Disconnect speaker connection. Remove SSD. Carefully disconnect display connection. Remove fan. Carefully remove the display. Carefully lift the motherboard. Clean the logic board. Remove the connector. Put opener and slowly lift the frame. Melt the plastic with iron. Same this side. Remove plastic from keyboard. We will melt these plastics. Lift keyboard with the opener. Melt the plastic locks with iron. Clean the housing space. Put the new keyboard. Press the keyboard. Melt new keyboard plastic locks. Clean the plastic cover. Put the cover back. Put the logic board back. Open the heat sink. Clean dry thermal paste from CPU area. Clean heat sink. Apply new thermal paste on CPU. Put the fan back. Put the heat sink back. Connect mouse pad connection back. Connect the keyboard connection. Connect fingerprint connection back. Put back connector board. Put back SSD. Connect the Wi-Fi connection. Connect display panel with keyboard housing. Connect the display connection. Put the hinges back. Connect the battery. Put the back cover back. Press power button. All done. See you in the next video. Bye-bye. Don't forget to subscribe.
it inspires me to make new videos in the 